Hey peeps. Hey guys, this is Titan. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good time. Welcome to my, well, my second public stream here live on YouTube. I hope now everything is working fine with um, the tech from the technical side. I hope you can actually see what I'm doing. I hope you can hear me. I hope the music in the background is not too loud. So whatever uh, may be that is wrong, definitely feel free to tell me. Um, after all, I'm not doing this just for myself, but um, to build something together with you and with your um, feedback. So, yeah, definitely, whatever is, just um, tell me and I'm sure we'll get it fixed. At least now with the beginning of the stream, we, can, we could actually start on time and not with 50 minutes delay due to some... Yeah, to be honest, I still don't know what the te technical problems of the last stream were, but whatever here we are uh, for this stream I actually also managed to um, find some yeah find some better background music because after this the last stream went offline and it was ready on YouTube um, on demand I got quite a lot of copyright claims quite a lot actually which is weird to me because the lofi music that I used isn't supposed to cause copyright claims I thought at least but um, yeah okay uh, so I downloaded a whole bunch of sort of smooth um, more quieter um, calmer rock songs from the YouTube audio library and so everything should work fine now another question um, that I came up to me what quality can you see the stream in cause um, the recording of the earlier stream I made is only available on YouTube in 360p, which is yeah quite low. So tell me if you can see the stream in 1080, and if not, then I'm sure we will we'll find the reason why that's not the case. But I'm hoping so. Either way, plan for today is of course, as I already said at the end of the last stream, the um, yeah we want to continue the station. And I hope that today we can finish remaking the station, or it's not completely redone, but at least um, bringing the station to modern standards as City Skyline Station should look in the year 2020. We actually did some good progress in the last stream. The track layout, um, at least on this side of the station, is basically done. There are just some minor things that I noticed afterwards, like, for example, you can see it here, the tracks, yeah, they, they, they don't look as smooth as they are supposed to look like. But oh well, um, that's fine, and we're gonna fix that today. So my hope is that we can yeah, finish the whole station area today including the um, embankments that go through the city. I'd like to also um, redo them and yeah, use some proper railway tracks and not um, these. These tracks of course were great um, back in the days, but with the current quality, it's just not, it's, it's, yeah, it's just not a thing anymore. And another thing that I'd like to do, but I really don't know if if we're able to do that today. Um, I'd like to also redo the um, central bus hub, which, yeah, it looked fine three years ago when I made it, but it really, yeah, I, I really don't like it anymore. The way it looks, it's just much too simple. And that's all in all, not really how a modern bus hub would look like. I already looked for some um, inspiration for a modern or more modern bus hub, so yeah, that's the plan for today. Station, embankments, bus hub, we'll see how much we can do, um, but either way, if you followed the news um, <laughs> from my side, um, you might have heard that my, um, my HDD, the drive that all my video files, my templates, projects, scripts, research I did everything was on um, an HDD drive and precisely this drive died yesterday meaning whatever I did in preparation the videos that I already produced I wanted to produce scripts 
everything for Vedarstein and Ansbrook's gone. Completely gone. I hope that the data can be res uh, restored or revived or whatever, taken back to life or brought back to life. Um, but yeah, in the meantime, until I either get all that data back or um, yeah, I can sort of remake everything I lost. Um, I think no videos from my side, but yeah, I, I can do some streams and focus more on asset creation. Also, Mesto, no you. Anyway, let's just um, start. So we finished last time with the track layout basically done. And as I already said, there are just these small irregularities, like for example, you can see it here. Um, this curves a bit to the left and it's just not really smooth. So this is something that before we continue with the catenaries, um, this is something I'd like to do as well as yeah, as well as just um, bringing everything onto the right height so we don't have these um, ugly jumps in the ground here. Hello, Bahn Fanatica. Uh, yeah, the train just despawned, Dimitri, because um, I haven't set up uh, yeah, custom lines so far. Maybe we can do that at, at the end of the stream. That would be a great goal um, working towards. So this is also something here that really isn't supposed to be like that. I mean, what is this? The track goes, sort of comes straight from here and then it makes like, like what's the, what's the corner here? So this is just something uh, small that I'd like to fix. And uh, almost. Now there is this, which track is it? Also, what did you say last time with move it, uh, steuerung, uh, control tab? No, not really. It doesn't work. What did you say last time about the keys with which I can sort of browse through? Ah, I did it. Okay, now it works. All right. So let me just move that node a bit. Ah! Ah! Come on! No, it's not working. Control tab is not working. Oh, it is. Sometimes it isn't. Sometimes it is. Whatever. Okay, so I think what I'm doing here is just moving that node a bit further away so that we can now check this segment here. And then this node should probably be a bit closer to the switch and then we can fix that and I think this should be it for this switch at least it looks much better than it did before not really from that side so uh, shit okay so, I mean, it's good how it looks now with like the sleepers, let's say almost aligned. But then there is this, this hook. Maybe I can align this so the hook isn't as noticeable. What do you say? Is that enough? Not really, I guess, because there is still some. I guess I'm going way too much into the details here, but I know my my train nerds and I know how much you hate these things. I mean, I do too, but just for the sake of making it better. Yeah, it looks fine. Now, this is a switch that definitely has to look different. So, question is, what am I gonna do here? Oh, also, I should quickly look if you can hear music. Yes, you can. Great. And okay, so that's done as well. And what's this? Oh, I think I use I used nodeless tracks there. And so there is no connection between them. Well, that's easily fixed. Hey, voila. 
that curve that is now in the tracks here. No, that looks fine. Who is a train nerd? I mean, I don't know. I can't imagine who would be something. Yeah, I, I really don't understand these weird as train nerds that I mean, some of these train nerds actually call themselves like that on online sites. It's just crazy. I don't know. Good. Um, now let's just slope them. So that slope is a bit smoother. Ah, oh, yeah, that looks better. The same go. Actually, the same should go for everything, but I think it's better to not select all of them at once. Because otherwise, it might just cause conflicts. Okay. These are selected, and. I guess I can do it like this. Slope objects. And independently from these tracks, I can slope these. And I um, how about Control Z? And we forget about that. Because I don't know what cause that now. Another thing that will be really interesting to see is if all the trains will go over the switches smoothly or if they will jump around like they, you know, tend to do. Yeah, that's really, that's still far from perfect. Hmm. First of all, let's align this a bit better. No. I wish there would be a set to detail the switches, for example, with a, in German called Herzstück or maybe also Radlenke. Oh, you. Yeah, you mean like these. Boom. Hallelujah. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. We, for, we, we, we forget about that. Even though this is now a bit. Oh god! <laughs> what is that? Uh, yeah, it would be can it would be great if the switches would also look more realistic, or at least there would be the possibility to look more realistic. So, Revel, just in case you're watching, do something about that. Make something that switches don't look like, you know, this. And this. Just make them look better. You mean like this vum vum? I wish rail intersections didn't have trains park on the intersections itself. I mean, that shouldn't happen? Or what do you mean? Okay. So. There was still some curve in the tracks there. That's done now. Same goes for this node. And actually, I think same goes counts for every node that is here. So that now the uh, yeah the rail yard is finished, sort of finished as well. And the tracks leading to the platforms, I think, also look. Fine. Maybe this switch could look a bit better. I guess if I move the node a bit. This looks good and... Oops. So, one thing that came up to me and I'd like to hear your um, opinions about that. There is a, yeah, a good amount of empty land here as well as here. Now on this stretch I'd like to keep it empty because yeah I don't think it would make too much sense to put um, some some uh, some dead end track here um, but I think here it would be ki would be good to have some yeah terminus track just for shunting trains so yeah give me your opinions on that if we could maybe from this track have a have a terminus track that goes here just for shunting trains. 
Hey, Varum. Great to have you here. Okay, so let's just... This switch could also be a bit better. And yeah. What's this? Are they connected? They... All right. Okay. I'm not, I'm not even gonna ask why they aren't connected. Which we're just gonna do it now. So, uh, Ronnie, and from Ronnie, I want nodeless, bidirectional, and without catenary. Please, thank you very much. So that we can directly connect it to this. And I hope this was no plop without a node. Of course, it wasn't. Uh, I really should finally um, get Electric's road tools. I, r I really should. Oh, you can't slope them if you only have selected one. No, that's a problem. I really should uh, get my hands on that mod just so I can remove unnecessary nodes. Or can add them more easily. Do you have the... Uh, Fuck! I forgot to subscribe to intersection marking tool. Damn it! Okay. No idea for the empty place. You want to let be empty. Put some vegetation on it. Yeah, of course. I'm not gonna keep it like that. At least some grass. Probably not some big bushes like there. Looking at it, they actually seem a bit too big. But I'm gonna put at least some grass here. But here, I'd really like some. Yeah, terminus dead end tracks just for shunting trains. You are a German guy or an English guy? I mean I, I, I'm i still thinking I have a really strong German accent which makes which sort of gives it away that I'm not a native English speaker. Not sure if service tracks should connect to mainline directly. Uh, yeah that may be a good point. Train nerds, your time to shine. Do service tracks connect directly to main tracks? I don't know. I would think so, but give me your opinion, because I know you're crazy about that. Same goes for a pro possible dead-end track here. Um, again, does it make sense or not? Yes, the Dominion network, I'm German, but why wouldn't I? I mean, I never said otherwise, so... oh. Shock to catch your face. <laughs> I get it now. <laughs> Damn it. Hey, German guy, what do you think about immigrants in your country? I mean, you know, this is a, not a political stream, but just to be safe, I couldn't care less. Seriously. But yeah. Don't, please don't make this into, political, into a political discussion. Because I know this is a rough topic. Also, just now that I see it, I really want to fill this empty hole here. Because it used to be filled with some building, but not anymore. I don't know why. It could be because I um, um, created a skip.txt file just to get rid of uh, most of the vanilla buildings. But sadly, that also means that this one got deleted. So um, my thought was just putting either um, a vanilla building that comes close to the one that stood here originally, which might have been that one. I think this is the building that used to be here before. It's, uh, well, it's a vanilla building, so mm, there's that. Um, but I think it's one of the better looking vanilla buildings, although looking at it now, it does look a bit cartoony and I can't... Okay, Painter does nothing. This is also good. Um, dampfen der Dosendackel. They do so in some cases. Why shouldn't it be a problem? Just make to be sure there's an additional switch or something to pretend cars from the dead end track to roll into the mainland mainline track. Oh, yeah, that's true. Sorry to Uglu Vanilla. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But... Yeah, okay, never mind. <laughs> I, I just was about to say we're just gonna PO it but yeah never mind let's just let's just put 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 this here uh, I don't know okay ban fanatic I'm gonna 
translate your 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 message into English. Um, they aren't connected to the main main line, but only a main track inside the station. Meaning service track um, do ser do do serve as as uh, nebengleis uh, minor track. I don't know. A Schutzweiche. What's that in English? A uh, security switch? No, that doesn't sound right. I don't know. Use the Eschenbach buildings. Yeah, guess what? I haven't subbed to them. <laughs> I know, I made them for Vedastein and I made them myself, but still I haven't subbed to them. On Vedastein, at least. Hello, Steve, voice of Satan. Oh, great to have you here. Um, today I'm just gonna finish the station, cause we didn't finish it in the last stream. And if time allows it, also the railway embankments through the city, as well as the bus hub. But I really don't know if time allows that. And yeah, I don't know about this here. Otherwise, there's of course also the possibility to use the other Malmö um, pieces from Beard Monkey. Okay. Uh, I, 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 I really don't like the new find, uh, the find new finded mod, or at least that new finded mod. I like how European cities have millions of people, but don't look overcrowded like Asia and North America. Yeah, I think that's just because the density in European cities is much lower. Why is that red? Like it's it's not supposed to be as red. So why is it this red? And I just leave it empty for now and gonna think about it later. Dump from the doors, Dackle Discord. You know, putting things in the Discord is is annoying because like it forces me to jump out of the game, which means that what you're seeing in the stream is just you know the pause screen. Um. So what you did there was a short dead end track to. Okay, yeah, that's something we can definitely do. Good. We have a plan, we have a plan. So, um, we just check Discord. Yeah, I mean, come on, come on. Don't write Discord stuff. That's, that's critical. You know, that's, that's not good, cause it forces me to jump out of the game and go into pause mode. And for those that didn't write me on Discord, it's just odd. Otherwise, I sort of have to, I don't know, include a separate Discord window into the stream and, yeah, show everything, everyone, um, what you're sending, which also is not really um, the way to do it, I guess. Either way, um, your wille möge geschehen. Oh, that wasn't English. Uh, your wish may be, may, may, may be fulfilled. Um, meaning we have this dead end track here that, oops, oops, now, control S, you go away, that go, come on, I did, or snapping on, <laughs> stop it, just stop it, game. control S, now it's all working. Um, so we're gonna have this dead end track here, and gonna connect it like this and since I still ha don't have electrics road tools I'm gonna d have to add a node there manually so <laughs> it's wonderful with the grass eagles oh well so this dead end track here which goes to there and this node should be directly in the middle of it all actually we can move this node as well and now that I'm on it, this could be moved a bit more into that direction, which I guess forces me to align this again. Nope. Good. So we're gonna do it like that. This is just a dead end on the other side to uh, stop cars to um, yeah roll into the main line, which yes, is very true, very true. So this would be it. Which, I don't know, it's, it does look a bit odd now. But I, 
I think it just would make sense to have it there for shunting trains around and stuff. Okay. But it's just well, uh, many things in the chat, many things in the chat. You can always turn on cinematic camera mode and I'll tap. Uh, why? Oh. That is true, I very much could do that. Um, why not make a house in the middle of the train lines because of some person refused to give up their lands for the trains? Yeah, no. As Jan Verkorken already replied, they didn't care about that back in the days. So that's that's not an option here. Um, so I guess we could... Oops. Yes, I could also press Ctrl H, but I'm just so used to doing it like this now. Um, all this should be on the same height. So... Actually, Control H, et voila. And this here, yeah, I don't know what's up with the terrain here. Maybe I'll have to fix it manually. One last time Discord, okay. One last time Discord. Okay, just gonna quickly reply. Just an idea, make the dead end wooden track with uh, make the dead end track with wooden sleepers and abandon the one switch on the main track so you can use abandon the one well in Europe for a long time it was that many okay that's another topic bah. all right all right all right yeah make should I do wooden sleepers would would they like redo the um these service tracks when they renovated the station or would they keep them wooden your accent for english is much better than before thank you and thank you very much because um i i really don't want to have um a very strong like like cliche german accent i know i have a rather strong one, but I'm at least sort of working of uh, working on getting rid of it. All right, all right, all right. So this is done now. Look, a train is coming. It's despawning in a second. Yeah, maybe uh, setting up some setting up some some custom train lines would be something great for the end of the stream. What do you use for a map theme and what for an LUT? Um, my map theme is Rheingold by Hades, but it's not publicly available, so um, yeah, you, I fear you can't use it unless you um, join her on, your, on her Patreon, but I don't think if she's still active there. Either way, um, LUT is, I actually have no idea, let me, let me, let me, let me have a look, not prop it up, um, I'm using Relight to Average. But I also um, use real light, which with now nowadays everyone should do. And I'm also using reshade, which um, just does some minor things to the game in terms of graphics. It's an ex external tool that is um, yeah, sort of embedded in the um, render engine. It just makes the whole overlay over over my. Well, you know, what I was about to say. Um, Reshade just makes the game look a bit more realistic. It has like, um, where is where's the, where's the key? It has like, wait. No. What is the Reshade key? Okay, I completely forgot it. Um, never mind, I can't show it to you. Okay, so this is it now. While I like having the track there, it just kind of looks out of place the way it it is there. I don't know why, but somehow it just does. Maybe it's not close enough to, to the other tracks. Also, next to track one could place another track without platforms for freight trains to have a rest or getting overtaken. There is so much space left. Where do you mean? 
Where do you mean as much space left? Like seriously, come on. I could, I get, I guess I could place it here, but uh, freight trains wouldn't drive into the valley because there is there is nothing there. At least nowadays they wouldn't. Freight trains. I don't know. Um, like there is the new high-speed rail that goes. Um, on a very steep slope, I think, goes um, up this valley, up this valley here, and onto the highlands, and then directly into the Czech Republic. And there is the old rail that winds um, through the, yeah, river valley. Which track would freight traffic use? Probably the new high-speed line. So I guess the yeah, the track for freight trains to be overtaken should be along the high-speed line. But I seriously wouldn't know. Where? Like, come on, there is no place. Make wooden sleepers, maybe, yeah. Between the station building and the first track. Uh, yeah, that would be here, but again, would freight trains still go um, along the course of the old line and along the river, or would they just use the high speed rail? Which I guess would make more sense. Um, could you add an abandoned Schmalspurbahn? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, great, great uh, Denglish there. Um, um, narrow rail. Yeah, um, I could. I don't know where, but I could. Like, could be that this line. Ew. Oops, this is also something that I should um, fix in the future. Um, could be that this line used to be. Um, with narrow whales, but isn't anymore. Um, but yeah, this is not really a map for narrow whales. Okay. Now that everything is done, I hope, I think. Actually, let me just, um, cause yeah, I, I think I agree of using wooden tracks here. It's, it can't hurt. No, no, not this. Oh, fuck. Oh, they don't have wires, right? They... Oh, I didn't download wooden tracks that have a wire. Well, well in that case, I suppose the decision was made for us to have it as concrete, because, yeah. Somehow I forgot to download wooden tracks without wires. Uh, with wires. Alright. Let's leave it concrete then. No, especially with this high slope for freight trains wouldn't use the HSR. Ooh, yeah, that's true. That's true. The slope is probably too steep for for high uh, for freight traffic. I mean, yes, in that case, another track next uh, next to the first track for next to the first platform would make or uh, would be possible for freight trains. You say that's that's a thing, but for local transportation, they were used partially in Western Germany. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I I'll think about the freight track here for freight trains to be overtaken, or I don't know for the driver having taking a break. Is it also a thing? Um, for now, I wanted to. Um, yeah, concentrate on the catenaries, and I think we should about uh, we should talk about that before. Should I? Would of course I'm gonna replace the retaining walls. Very, don't worry. Um, should I? Would I? Could I use um, Quertragwerke, which in English is quarter works? I don't know. What what is what is Quertragwerk in English? Actually, that is something I need to look up because it's an, a, a too important term. Quertragwerk is in English. <laughs> there is no English term for it. Seriously, come on. What does Vic? Holy shit! There is no English term for it. Never mind. What I'm talking about are big catenary masts, like. You know, just for the for the for the people that don't uh, speak English, uh, 
<laughs> for the people that don't speak German, um, what I mean with this term are... Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, shit. I didn't? Did, okay, I did. Um, so these. Should I, could I, would I use... Quertragwerke or not? No, you shouldn't. Headspan catenary, okay. Because I looked it up on Dict and actually on Wikipedia, so like I opened the German Wikipedia article and wanted to have the English version, and there is no English version. Mm, what to do? Okay, so you're saying um, they aren't necessarily used anymore and wouldn't. Alright, then not. Then we're gonna have a lot of fun now. Um, so what... Transverse support structure. Okay. Interesting. So, my idea for the catenary masts was a sort of, yeah, a style that I already did on, at, in, I don't know, my, um, my uh, build for uh, Neustadt, oops, where I presented it, which had these, um, which had the big masts and cantilevers on both sides, which, yeah, to me, looked fine. And I'd like to um, use that concept here as well. Actually, we should PO that one. Just gonna make it much easier. Convert to PO. And then we can convert this to PO. And yeah, now we're gonna have a lot of fun. Of like, putting it all into place. So... So at least now it's fixed on the mast and it probably isn't high enough. Oh god, I hate it. I hate it already. Thank you very much. Can't see shit. No new catenary systems, don't use them. Okay, okay. Wederstein is back on track. Hoo hoo, yes. Yes, it is, it is. And now I think it'll it'll be the only project for, for some time. Uh, maybe in order to prevent Preserve Wederstein history near the station. What you mean? Hey, Austrian spider. This is is exactly what would be built IRL. Oh, you mean these? Great. Then I'm. I like the look of them, but it's easier to repair stuff on the catenaries with single masts. Yeah, I think. I mean, that's as far as I know the main point of um or the main point of why they got rid of 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 Quertragwerke. Um in need of a better English term because they aren't good to maintain meaning if something breaks you have to um, uh, you have to uh, you have to um, shut it down completely this is what I wanted to say so is that too big this one this cantilever don't forget to make a layer for POs yeah, I should. I, so far, I haven't looked that much into making layers. Um, but I totally agree, I should do it. Um, it has to be a bit higher. That's of course totally possible. Just a teeny tiny bit. Et voila. There we go. And now we're gonna have that on every track all around the station this is gonna be so much fun nice titan is using new gravels i gave him yesterday ah oh, shit <laughs> oh fuck i forgot about that yeah next time next time uh this is just pain you can't really let them match exactly this is the thing about yeah i know i can't have them um match exactly but at least as as much as possible uh, no. 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 Move two and rotate. Afterwards, we can just align the heights. Actually, they are aligned like this. 
this one should be rotated and we're gonna do that in a second actually there was a switch here and there was a switch there so I think we have to move that whole mast by just a little bit so it holds the wire over that switch there which sadly means that I think those should be... Re no, okay, they still fit. Eh, voila! Dampfen that it's doable, just requires a bit of work and know how which angles to... <laughs> so the track layout is finished already? Um, yes, I, I hope so, at least. If, if it's not finished, then I'm wondering what we did the last three hours in the last stream. So, I hope it's finished, okay. Um, at least on this side. The other side is not yet finished, which... <laughs> yeah, well... <laughs> It's, 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 and then, then we have this here and then yeah, no 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 the other side is not yet finished and this is something um, that we're gonna do when we're done with this side here so oops wrong key oh it actually is still right so and as this one should be rotated, how is the dumbest thing I can do that? Because as far as I know, you can't like select a, an axis to rotate it around, right? Oh, you can. This is great. This is great. It's choosing its own axis. This is great. That means that... So, it's good. And now we can. Uh, this isn't really working as intended. How about we move that a bit closer and make the cantilever a bit shorter here? Does that make sense? Please tell me it does make sense. Is it too long? I mean, it does look very, very long. Also, bots about sickness. Ha 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 Yeah, no, I don't really want to align the sleepers because, at least not in the stream. This is something I, I'm gonna do. If I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it after the stream or whenever I feel like. Like, yeah, I want to kill myself. Hey, Aquascape in Luxembourg. Welcome to the madhouse. At least now we can just copy that one over yeah, roughly over here. Problem is that the upper cantilever doesn't work anymore because there is only a single track on the other side. But I don't think that sh uh, yeah, that shouldn't be a big problem to use another one there. So you go away. Yes. And there should be a single one but oh that's the one without the 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 the, the thing that holds the wires I don't know those catenary masts are holding up three wires per side so it isn't too long okay great um I think mm -hmm. I guess I could use this one here and then plop an arm on it. Oh god, this is so annoying already. Like seriously, ah. That's the only good way to do it. Ah. No, change of plans. Because I think it's it's way faster if I'm just gonna copy that one. Um, rotate it in its position. And just, you know, get rid of... Question is, where should I... Oop. Oop. Okay. Um, just get rid of the arm here. Never to be seen again. Oops. Just open Steam. 
Uh, never to be seen. Oh no, that totally... No, that makes even, even less sense. <laughs> um, I can live with that. I, I think that's fine. Um, you should maybe place the cat in every where the wires bends, or better to say where the break in game and have corners. Yes, yes, yes. Totally agree. Which is there. Not here. Which. Oh. Yeah, I. I just uh, sort of mis mislooked. So. It should be around here. Because that is also where the two. Uh, where the two wires of these two tracks um, merge. So this is the um, proper spot to put them. Yes, you're totally right. I, I wanted to do so, I just like... Uh, yeah, I thought it's on a different place. What is what is this vertex there actually? So this goes there now and... I feel like this is really long like really long this is fine there were often such long catenary holders is that the english term oh, i don't know oh this also isn't supposed to be like that but we can change that of course but now it's really long like really long I hope it's still fine. Just just tell me if it's still fine or if I should fix it. Also, don't forget that wires are only about one... <laughs> um. Suck it. No, I'm gonna... I'm not gonna add the wire changing stations. Also, I'm just gonna have a sip of my tea. Maybe... Now that I I think I'm definitely gonna stream a bit more, I finally should get a camera, because then you wouldn't see my fancy chirpy mac. Limited, limited edition city skylands chirpy mac. Um, I work on NS2 cantilever only props later. Oh, yes, do that. But first, Dosto, make Dosto. That's some good green tea. Um, okay, I have to get rid of, of these catenaries here. Problem is how, because I don't have touched this. Um, tell me, how can I get rid of these without touch this? Because what I need to do is just... Uh, yeah... How? Hey, Christopher. You need wire changing stations. Hell no. Hell. Yeah. I'm. Hell no. No. Like, w w do you have an idea how to get rid of these without touch this? Cause I'm not gonna restart the game now just to get touch this. If you also have no idea, then I'm just gonna ignore them for now and restart the game once the stream is done and remove them then use wireless tracks uh, and a wire network yeah that would be a, an idea do I have a wire network I think I have yep okay that's a possibility sadly that means I have to replop the platforms which is annoying but oh well Replace the station and then select the right tracks with the railway mod. Yeah, I have to re replace the platforms. Those changing stations sound completely complicated, but in fact, on the open track, they aren't. I mean, yeah. Um, yeah, maybe, possibly. I never tried it. I never tried making these wire changing stations or changing um, masts. In City Skyland, so I wouldn't know. Either way, um, next mast, and we're gonna. Well, there's a switch here, so I think it should cover these 
three tracks and the next one could cover these three slash four tracks in case I'm gonna add um, another track there which is seriously I don't know if I should do that oh I mean I know it despawns in a second and and the masts are not perfect and all but whoever you did just didn't you seriously did a great job Would it be even better if we have dusters, you know? Why is there grass on your tracks? It's because I haven't deleted it yet. Which can be done just as just as we speak. Oh. It's a tree. Okay. Just as we speak. Um that grass is from the uh, yeah, from the from the first version. But it makes more sense here. But I'm also going to delete it and maybe add it later. Good. Now that that's all settled, next mast. And I want that. Um, yeah, pretty much where that mast is. I think that small wa waiting roof has to leave, but no problem. You should add a track next to track one, otherwise this huge empty space there looks weird. Yeah, I totally agree on the fact that it does look weird. I, I have no idea why I made it like that, but yeah, I totally agree on that. Look, that arm is growing even longer. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> At which point does it start to look ridiculous with an arm that long? Because <laughs> I feel like... It already starts looking ridiculous. That's fine enough. And uh, that, and there's no connection there, so we're just gonna fix that. I think. I think with all the platforms being so wide, I should use no, no, no grass. No grass would be unrealistic. Okay, maybe use the green arm and the small cantilever instead. Either that, or I'm just gonna use a completely different um, uh, cantilever there. Meaning, please tell me you already made a pre-made one. I was talking about using this one, but without the the first cantilever that's fixed to the mast, 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 to the mast, mast. Bah. Do you plan first person rides? Um, first of all, yes. There, are, even though, even if I wouldn't plan first person rides, there are reasons to make it as as detailed as this. Um, I noticed that when I made the um, scenery for my Neustadt station, it just looks so great um, with all the cantilevers and catenaries um, set up precisely. So, yes, I'd like to do some first-person rides when, once there is a, a bit more of a track that I can actually use for it, because right now there isn't that much. But um, even if I wouldn't, it's it still would be worth the um, the effort. Oh, by the way, for these straight double tracks, you could use simply a catenary that stands in the middle of both tracks. Alright. I could... You know what? You're totally right. At least it saves... Yeah. Time, time, time. Uh, but what do I do? Revo. Uh... Wait a minute. That doesn't make sense. Because I already used them. Like, they are here. So they are definitely there. Why aren't they here? Are they from Ronnie? No. Revel made them and added them to the game. I am confusion. Maybe they aren't. No, that's the same. Uh, 
Invisible catenary and what's that? Those are all invisible. Um, I mean, I could, I should, and I'd like to, but you can't seriously tell me that I didn't sub to them. Like, I can find them by searching catenary middle. I mean, even if I look for catenary. Those are the ones by Tim the Terrier that is... Okay, now they're there. Uh, didn't I just look for Catenary? Okay. Never mind. Yeah, it's it's better to use those. Just for... Yeah. It's easier, it's simpler, it's, it's uh, quicker done. I just... Um, personally, I... I don't know why, but I really like these big masts I I don't know why but they they just have a sort of um, yeah I just like them yes dozen dackel explode please explode for us maybe you can hang them on the roofs good yeah um, I don't know do they have middle catenaries or not can I post links here? Uh, try. No idea. Try. I'm not that experienced. Like big masts, what a surprise. <laughs> so what, can I use them or not? Ban Fanatica. You're the one who drives on tracks constantly. It's your turn. Can I use them or not? Because <laughs> at least it would make things so much easier. But then again, these look better. They just look, just look at them. Ah. Some catenaries crosses entire stations. Yeah, but those are the, the Quertragwerke, as we already established. Unter der Kante hängt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't think there would be enough space for that here. Nah, maybe there would be. I don't know if this would be realistic, because with those view on the signal, on the distance, middle masts are a common thing, at least in Austria, but... Bahn Fanatica says it's not that, it might possibly and not that realistic because it blocks the driver's view of the signals, which, uh, yeah, I think that's, that's definitely a point. Hey, WJ. Hmm. So what are we going to do here? Because I seriously would tend to use the big ones, you know. The big masts. Same in Sweden, but this is a German town. I'm just gonna trust. Um, I'm just gonna trust Bahn Fanatica here. And then again, I just like these big ones, cause <laughs> you know, big stuff. <clears throat> I'm sorry, this is a Christian stream. Uh, oops. I am confusion so that I can use these here because yeah could be that it is possible and I know in Austria I have seen it like that and uh, who was it that said in Sweden is it uh, demolition daddy <laughs> great name um, says in in Sweden it is also used like that but I'm John I'm just gonna use the big the big the big stuff here also tea time Cat <laughs> catenari. Middle masts aren't that common in Germany. They exist, but not as often as maybe in other nations. Okay. Use mast networks. I was told not to use them, so I won't. So I'm just gonna use the. I should cu add custom text to them just to find them easier. What did I use before? Cantilever? Yeah, okay. Uh, no, that's gray. Gray. Where were the green ones? 
care about the green ones. Um, I'm gonna use that one and flatten the first one. I think that's the easiest one. I've sent you two images how it is in Mannheim. Yeah, but you know, images in stream are, are, are critical. What should be the reason not to use them? Um, apparently they're not used anymore. Or am I thinking of the wrong catenary networks? But you, you mean the, the Quertragwerke, right? Apparently they're not used anymore. Or just, what did I do wrong now? Uh, that's fine. And we're gonna do the same here. What? That's not a reason. Why isn't it a reason if I say they're not used anymore? Can you do a City Skylands multiplayer series? Uh, I guess I could. I mean, like in collaboration with like the viewers, I could. But um, yeah, I'm. While I have nothing against the concept, I usually have so many plans myself for my cities that I wouldn't want anyone else um, but me working on the city. Because I most of the times I already know perfectly well what I want and what I don't want. No, um, Revo Quertragwerke, whatever the English term may be, um, supposedly aren't used anymore or aren't built anymore because they are just critically or just annoying to maintain meaning that if one um, cantilever on them breaks you have to like block all the tracks but I guess for very big um, rail yards or stuff they are still used if, like I'm just the one who listens to the train nerds and does the stuff they say okay Please talk, I, I, I refer to Ban Fanatica, because he's the, you know, Ban Fanatica. Oh, turning it in, oops, turning it into a PO could help. I think the height for these other ones also wasn't right, so, yeah, it's still too low. So these two and align heights to that one. No. Then the middle mast is to. Oh, you can't move to it once. <laughs> Edit. And they sh should be around that high. And now you can align the heights. Um, so, yeah, they're kind of unusual. You mainly see them. Yeah, okay. So uh, now can I can do what I wanted to do, meaning um, this whole thing uh, with that gets flattened and we're gonna get rid of it. Bye bye. And now I can use this one here just so um, these arms aren't ridiculously long. The only thing that annoys me now is that the mast is too high. Or is it? At least these ropes are too high, so let's just do it like this. I can live with that. Hey, Leon Dan. Okay, another thing that I should do, I think, is setting the render distance of these POs a bit higher because how far away can I go? Like they disappear at... Okay, I think it's fine. Maybe I could turn the render distance just a tiny bit higher on them like what is it, is it now 
1.4 kilometers. Ah, I think it's fine. I think it's fine. So now at least I can just copy them over here. And it's just way faster. <laughs> it's great here. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of that um, later. At least later. This doesn't work. We're gonna make it work. Customization and... Et voila. And with this side... I mean, yeah, if, if you say I'd, I definitely should add a track here for um, freight trains to be overtaken, then yes, I totally agree. But you also said it has to be at least 500 meters in length, which I don't think is possible here. I'm just going to use my prop line tool and rock method to measure it out. So let's set the spacing to 100 and 100, 100. So we have uh, 400 meters for the station or for the platform and yeah, let's say 450 maximum 500 meters. So I don't know, I don't, yeah. Is it possible to add a freight? Um, track next to it. Is it long enough for them? Tell me. Nah, it looks out of place. You look out of place. Hey, Kaio. Okay, then. You tell me if I should add a freight track there, and in the meantime, I'm just gonna copy these masts. Uh, good thing is now that these small catenaries are placed. I know perfectly well where I should place the big ones. And uh, ha, 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 so, and this works as well. Wonderful. And the next one is here. Now we just have to align like this. And this works as well. Yes, it does. Wonderful. So the first, the first three are done. And that actually means I can already place the next one in the same distance, which would be here. And this is this. And yeah, say what you want, but I, I personally, per, per, personally really like these big ones. Titan is using green version instead of gray. Yes. Bahn Fanatica, it should be at least 500 meters long, more likely six or 700 meters. Yeah, we don't have the space for 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 seven or 800 meters yeah, or six or 700 meters, whatever. Like the platform is 400 meters long, which is fine. Um, then we have maybe an yeah, no, no, it, like the maximum length for that freight traffic track would be 450 maximum. And if you say that's definitely too short, then not possible. Bye bye. Not possible. So you tell me if a short one also works then or not. Please fix the clipping through the roofs. The way I should fix the clipping would be like having a hole in the roof because oh, it's not in the middle that's annoying and it's even more annoying considering the oh I aligned it to <laughs> I aligned it to the waiting room roof and not the platform middle Oops. like the, the I the way I should align it is, I think, adding a, a, a hole here, because they need to go to the ground, which is... Uh, a short one would look better than nothing. Yeah, I agree. Then let's let's just do a short, short freight um, traffic track there. And then I can finalize the catenaries along the platforms. Also, first of all, I have to take a sip of my tea.
good tea. Very good tea. Um, da -da -da -da. Honey. Oops. And this trick, and this is going to be annoying now. Although, I think we have to use elevated ones either way. Still no kitten here. Great. So, let's do it here first. Or first of all, let's do it here. And so that it... No. Oh. <laughs> that was a bit too high. Oops. So that it connects to the other track around... So, I guess. Not with that curve. Uh, like this, I guess. And now let's bring it to a, a more reasonable height. Et voila. Um, first of all, again, why did I use terrain conforming platform props there? Like, seriously, what did I do? Where did that idea even come from? Uh, sometimes I'm really asking myself what I'm doing. Um, a short one would look better. Oh, okay. Okay. So. Let's just move that node a bit closer to the switch. So that we can do this like that. <laughs> like why? There was a sinking hole. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's just pretend it was an earthquake and it all sank down. Tomato juice with garlic and dill. That is some very interesting choice. Okay. Good, let's just fix these platforms. Oh, I think I know why I use the... Never mind, no, I don't. It's just, you know, the sins you do in your youth. Which in that case is true because it's three years ago. Back then I was young. Oh, I'm old. Oops. So I can just copy these ones now and good, they aren't going. They're in conforming. And just do it way quicker. Or oh, wait, oh, oh, well, just do that quickly. Uh, da -da -da -da. So we're just going to align the upper ones and do the lower ones afterward. And then we're fine again. Mm. No. USA stuff is easy. I am, but it's... A <laughs> I'm not really a big fan of tomato juice. But... Okay. My boyfriend also likes it, but he also drinks sauerkraut juice, which, yeah, is a thing, and apparently it does taste well. I haven't tried it, because, like, the thought freaks me out of drinking sauerkraut juice, but apparently it's some good stuff. Even though I like, I very much like sauerkraut, but a juice, yeah, I don't know. Not my cup of tea. Uh, 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 uh. So we have the curvature like this, and oh, it's not working as I thought it would. Oof. Oof. Then we just have to do it manually, which takes a teeny tiny bit longer. And it has to be done. Tomato juice is the happy well. I don't know. I'm I'm just more a fan of you know classic, normal, 
juices from fruits. Never mind, tomato is fruit. Normal classic sweet juices like orange or apple or grape. Pomegranate? Pomegranate? I think. Good. So, as it stands now, we just have to copy this um, candy lever on that side over here. Bye bye. To uh, connect the freight tracks. Freight track. Single person. <laughs> Pineapple is awesome. Yes, it is. You know what's even better? Why are there no wires here? Couldn't you have told me that I... Oh. I didn't pick the invisible one. I... Picked the... Uh, I picked no one. Okay. Never mind. Um, pineapple is great. You know what's also great? Pineapple pizza. Just telling the two, you know. I know some of you guys really hate pineapple pizza. <laughs> oh no, and now I have to redo this platform as well. Oh no, fuck it. My, <laughs> come on. This is just annoying. So, um, then these. Ground, please. These also don't have uh, overhead wires, and now they have. Great. Do I really need. What, what, what did I do wrong? Oh, you meant because of the pineapple pizza. Yes, it's great. I love it. It's, it's just. wonderful. Best pizza you can imagine. Oh, I love it. I love it. <laughs> I, don't, I seriously don't know what's the problem with it. It tastes so great. Like, the mix between the sweet pineapple and the, like, hearty, you know, cheese and tomato sauce. It's just... Ah, I love it. Okay. So these ones go here. In the middle of the platform now. And as we see, they aren't properly aligned to the overhead wires. Both of them aren't, in fact, which means I can just move both of them at once which makes it just a bit more quick a bit a bit quicker also i can't believe how long uh oops this was the mask i can't believe how long i'm working on these few catenary masts already which yeah it, it doesn't seem like we're gonna we're gonna achieve much in that stream at least if I manage to properly finish the whole station area, I have something to show after the stream. So first of all, I have to get rid of these catenaries there. Uh -huh, et voila. This works. Um, this is supposed to be like that. It's for baby trains. Baby trains stop here and they have a very low entrance and so the platform has to be tilted, just so you know. <laughs> yeah, we have just, just, yeah. 50% discount for patron seems fine. <laughs> ah, that's good, isn't it? Nice. Is it? 
Is it maybe an East German thing to like pineapple pizza and and all the different similarities? Like we also have toast Hawaii, which is pineapple toast, which is basically the same but on toast. Is it maybe an East German thing? I don't know. Okay, so we have middle mass there. Here, um, a single mast either in the middle of the platform or on the retaining wall would be best, I think. And I'd be inclined to put it on the edge of the retaining wall. Just so it's not, yeah, just not so every mast is standing on the platforms. Why are there semaphore signals? Because when I made the station, it was very old and they did use semaphore signals back then. Yes, you have to compensate because of GDR. <laughs> Toast Hawaii have literally nothing to do with East Germany. Yeah, I don't know. What's just in, what's just a guess? Uh, oh, actually, I should use a different candidate over here. Because uh, the one that, yeah, this one. Copy and no. Rotate H and so we can just use that one which fits better. No, no, so that's enough. as well I also guess on a wall would be more realistic yeah I thought so too at least it does look um, better in my opinion to have it like that so I think the next catenary should be here where the switch is and question is what sort of Catenary am I gonna use there? I think I'm gonna use the same one I have here. Or? I mean, there should be three um, arms, cantilevers, whatever here. So probably three on that side and only um, a single one on that side. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. Do I already have one with three that I can copy? Nope. So we're gonna use this one. We're gonna use the mask. The mask from here. And it's Yeah, I think it should be somewhere here. Yep. Can till not not till. Kenti, Kanti, and the green mastered has three arms on it. What what's the proper name for these? The the bright the bright metal thingies that hold the overhead wires are those. Like I'm calling them arms constantly. What's better, cantilever? But isn't the green big? The green big uh, metal bar the cantilever? So what are these bright ones then that actually hold the wire? Oi! I don't have red hair. I read that. Don't you dare. I have uh, chestnut brown hair. Actually it's really funny. My hair uh, has a different shade on uh, depending on the sun and on the on the weather and on the lighting. It's It's, it's really odd. No, oops. No hairdresser so far was able to actually tell me what. Oh, it's not a PO. Never mind. No hairdresser so far was actually able to tell me what hair color I have. It's also the longer it is, the darker it gets. But the whole hair, not just like um, the, the, the end of it, but the whole hair gets longer. It gets darker the longer it is. I, I really don't know. 
I have very funky hair. Oh, it's a bit. I have to. Oops. I have to. I have to move it up first. Yep. Perfect. Uh, da, 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 da. Then cantilever is a uh, cantilever. Big green stuff is must, but is this this long bar metal bar is that also the must 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 whatever to pronounce it because I always thought that's the cantilever but I might be wrong okay and this third one we're gonna rotate uh, this third one we just quickly go on a rotate so that now we can make it like this and oh this is annoying now okay how about we move it a bit further away just so we have a bit free room um but I don't have a metalhead long hair haircut because my hair doesn't work with uh, if it's very long. It's like it's like middle long at the moment and I really should um, go to um, the hairdresser again. It's not part of the mast, it's part of the mast, not the cantilever. Okay, great. So mast, mast, cantilever. Thanks. Uh, this looks odd. But I guess it's fine. If not, yeah, tell me. And just the last one would be here, just for this last track where the switch is. Nope. Align heights, wonderful. And wow. No. No. Oh, it's not. It's not. It's not perfectly aligned with the switch, which is a bit annoying now. But uh, should I? Should I? Uh, yes, I should, because otherwise it's gonna bother me for all eternity if it's not aligned with the switch. Uh, sorry. Where is it? It's there. Yeah. Problem is now I have to align these again. <laughs> Never gonna finish it like that. I mean, it can't. It can't. This, 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 yeah. You see, this is why I wanted to do this on stream instead of a video where I like redo um, some older parts, because this is no. This is nothing you can do in a video, in my opinion. This is nothing that like needs to be shown and commented on. It's better if we sort of do this together. I have your direct feedback on it and it's great. This is a very strong wrong steam what? streams on OnlyFans tomorrow. Hmm. You wish baby, you wish. Uh, check out Titan's collection for Vedastein on Steam. The link is in the video description. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry if I missed the question there. I was concentrating on the big fat green masts. Okay, so maybe we could place another one in the middle of this here, but I don't think it's really that necessary. It's we're getting there, we're getting there. And if you don't mind, we are like 1.5 hours in the stream, so I'd quickly make a pee pause <laughs> and make another cup of tea. And then I'll be back in just one or two minutes with a fresh cup of tea and we're gonna finish this side of the station. And I'm not gonna end the stream before the other side of the, of the station is finished as well. So stay with me, I'll be back in just a few minutes.
Alright then, back we are. I made, I made a tea, a tea and a pee break. Actually, also a water break because now I also have a glass of water. Because talking constantly made my mouth really dry. Also, my throat, as I already said last time, is not used to talking English constantly, which I, I really can, I, I can feel it. So just a glass of water now as well. But I hope. I'll get more used to talking English um, as, you know, time progresses. Maybe we, um, I do more streams and, and yeah, all that, that, that whole charade. Good. Let's, let's continue here. And I think I'm just gonna continue... With, uh, with that bit here, there is another switch there, so we, we're gonna have that mask configuration here as well, maybe also in the middle. But before I'm gonna do that, I quickly have to like remove the tea bag from the tea, cause it's green tea and it's not supposed to, uh, to, to, yeah, I don't know, to be in the tea too long was two and a half minutes could also be the internet connection in Germany in general yeah <laughs> well but well you think so because like when the the pause screen is in um, full HD then why wouldn't the stream be in full HD as well to me that doesn't sound like it's in connection problem but more like a yeah um, um, OBS problem YouTube problem one of those sounds more likely to me to be honest but uh, I, I don't know just a guess okay next catenary is here and so we're just gonna move that one a bit Oops. like this ah oh, it wasn't perfectly on the on the switch but yeah it's it's fine it's fine it's like one centimeter of which is a margin of error for me at least and like this and this like this you know of course it it definitely takes some time to align all the catenary masts but once you have sort of um, once you have a few masts ready it's much easier to um, also align all the other masts and it definitely pays off in the end so we're gonna have that same mask configuration here oh no we can have a triple um, a triple cantilever here and a single one over there so it's we already had that it's this mask configuration that we need so yeah this is what you uh, what I mean once you have sort of a, a selection of different um, configurations of uh, mask setups it's much it's much simpler to align 
or to uh, yeah to build them all properly I see it wasn't oops am I am I changing the depth of field oh. but like why Wait. Oh. <laughs> Oops, wrong keys. Never mind. Um, ba -ba -ba. They have internet in Germany, uh, supposedly, but it's still Neuland here. So, but yeah, we supposedly there are areas in Germany that have this, this, this internet they call it not sure what what's the point of this but yeah they have a similar system in way thank you titan for a break now i have coffee with pepper and cinnamon seriously coffee with pepper and cinnamon like does it work for real So I myself like to try some new stuff so um, I can understand that you're uh, into trying new new food ideas, but does it work really? Okay. Um, 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 uh, uh, what are we gonna do here? So what if I just select it like this? It actually worked great. I mean, this is quite long, but I think that's still fine. It's, it should still be fine. Says the man who's eating pineapple on pizza. Hey, no, I also fuck you. I di <laughs> I didn't say uh, 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 I didn't say that I don't like it or that it's gross or whatever. I was just like, does it work? Whereas you people are just so, uh, you're just so mean, you know, pineapple on pizza is great, but you can't, uh, you just, you just don't accept it. Um, next one, kettle level, cantilever, <laughs> man, catenary. Don't get a lever. Uh, so that we can use the end. Ah, there's no end. Ma where is. I need a green end master green. That's grey. I guess I could also use a grey one, but. Uh -huh. How is that one called? Uh, catenary single and uh, that's critical because I can't just use the uh, name as a sort of pattern so I find the green one easier. Catten green. Okay. Don't I have a green end mast or is there no green end mast? Did I just forget to sub to it? Either way, let's just gonna use. Uh, let's just use the gray one. I don't care. Imagine this TV show in the US. What TV show? You mean me saying swear words? Yeah, sorry, that's just me. And that's something I'll never get rid of. That is just me. So, actually, instead of men uh, aligning it manually on the head to the head, let's just do it like this. And ah, yeah, wonderful. One there full. Okay, so then we have to do the same on the other side or on the other end. But over there it's higher, I think. I think it is. Is it not? Oh no, it doesn't look like it. Uh, yeah. Also, the, the tracks and wires are a bit higher than on the other end, which I guess really shouldn't be like that. Uh, I'm gonna keep it like that for now. <laughs> now, nah, just commenting or something about something on local TV. Okay. 
Maybe you could enlarge the search box. Uh, yes. Yes, it would make things easier. But still, either there is no green and catenary or I didn't sub to it, which is just as likely. That I just, you know, um, oversaw it. I overlooked it. Okay. Then there is another switch here and another switch there. For this switch we need maybe just a single mast. And for this we can just use, you know, um, a mast with three cantilevers. So this one here. So we take this one, copy and gonna paste it here where this switch is. First of all, roughly in the middle. And then where the switch is, so yeah, so roughly like that. Problem is, it's probably way too tall now. I don't know. Let's see. No. Where are the wires? Yeah, it's it's too high above the tracks so this should be right now let's align the heights and we can align the cantilevers which looks a bit dumb now because a bigger one would probably work better there but i'm too lazy now and i'm gonna keep it like that for, for this is, it, is this how the end masks are used in real life? No. Why no? What? Why no? Like, mast? End of, like... Why not? Or was it no too? There is, there is green end mast. Oh, yeah then... Yeah, somehow I forgot to sub to it. But it's fine. There is worse, there were worse things then. I'm um, using a different mast color. Now this is not high enough. Okay. Let's just fix it easily. I do it like this. Those little terrain differences in the gravel tiles are driving me crazy. You think? I don't know how, 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 I, I can't understand why. Yeah, I'm gonna fix that, don't worry. Maybe look at, maybe I forgot to release it, but, um, at me. I don't, yeah, I mean, I don't know if I just forgot to sub to it. Um, it's just as likely. It could be that I sub to the, um, uh, but, uh, but I'm the talking and doing things at the same time is critical. Um, it could be that I sub to the green beam, ca uh, the green beam cat catenaries, and the green and wait, the green beam catenaries, the green masts, but not the green mast catenaries. That I didn't sub to those. That could be because in that case I wouldn't have the um, end mast. Actually, let me just look it up. Yeah, I only have, oops, uh, oops, I have green beam and I have gray truss, or what did you call it? I don't know, gray, gray truss and green beam, I don't have green truss. Hello, Krota, son of Oryx. I awaited you, you know, you're late. Oops. No. Oh, Goody. So. Et voilà. And. Good thing is we're almost done with the cantilevers. Or with the catenaries on this side of the station. So there's. There's, there's a goal inside. Eh. Uh, in, inside. In. You, like. Like. 
inside. Not inside. Inside. Um, the green beam. The green beam beam. Yes. Okay, we have that. Uh, yes, exactly. I wanted to put a single thing here. Just, you know, for the, sli for the switch. Like here. And... Oh, it's not PO. Nah, no, it's no problem. I don't have to PO it. Whoops. So. You expect stream? No. I'm planning to use the Remagen Bridge for my main train bridge. Ooh. Nice. You know that little mast here looks really out of place. Is it done like that in reality? Because it just looks totally out of place. But it really wouldn't make sense to do it otherwise. I guess. You tell me. In the meantime, I'm just gonna keep it like that. Although it looks just, just ridiculous. Uh, oh, never mind. I don't need that one. Good. So this is done. The platforms are done. What's left is this mess. Yes, this is also common IRL. Okay, okay, okay. Very good. Um, I know Quertragwerke aren't used anymore. Does that also count for rail yards? Because I'd really like to use one here just for simplicity. You know, after after that, after that uh, sentence, after that quote from you, we, yeah, I'm sorry. Yes, you're you're not late, but that just. Just reading that quote from you, uh, quota, 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 quota. Uh, just reading that quote from you, Sweden, my day. Thank you. Uh, oh, come on. What? What? Down. And for the other tracks and okay questions quest question question quest god question my god question quest I uh, can't pronounce question in a sentence. Uh still standing. Should I use Quertragwerke here or not? Because I'd very much like to. Also, why are these not the same length? Like What did I do here? Why? Isn't it like the most obvious thing to make them the same length? Apparently not, not for me, I know. That really shows how old this whole safe is, because nowadays I I'd never do such... Yeah, such... such it just triggers me that it's not the same length, so why did I do it back in the day? Yeah. Well, your BV looks like it was rebuilt. Otherwise, there would be some historic buildings like a turntable and a roundhouse. So yes, it also counts for it. I don't want. Okay. But yes, it definitely is rebuilt. There is like nothing left of what I guess would have been an old um, rail yard. About track for freight trains, you could easily extend the length to 600 or 700 meters, leading the freight track in parallel with the passenger tracks toward the exit of the city. Um, well, yes, but you know, there were already backyards and stuff and I don't want to remove them, so no, not, not, I'm not gonna do it. Just because I want to keep the backyards the way I did them. 
Safi? Moin. Okay, so if I can't use Quertrag weg here, I'm just gonna use a big fat, a big fat mast in the middle and cantilevers with three, uh, or arms with three cantilevers on each side. Just so it's like the, 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 the manual solution to Quertragwerke, I don't know. The alternative would be to rebuild it in a historic way with roundhouse, etc. How about... Nope. Kanti, can, Kanti. Kanti. Uh, so... Where's the mast? Huh? I'm too lazy, let's just copy it, copy it from somewhere else. So, I think there should be two masts. 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 One here, and one in the middle, and I think it should be enough. I think I'm doomed. I just subscribed to all of Revo's train maintenance building packs. Yes, you are. <laughs> yes, okay. I'll let you wear it hot. Um, so, yeah, that works fine. So, no Quertragwerke, but... I mean, that's basically the equivalent to a Quertragwerk, so... Meh. Um, convert to BO. And let's just see if they're already on the proper height. Probably not. Well, almost, actually, almost. Now it looks like they are. Okay. Problem is, they're not properly fixed on the mast yet, so. And now we can. Align them to the overhead wires. I have a. You have a what? I have a. Quenit Vorsiofoisten. You have a question for me, bus stop today? I seriously don't think so anymore. Because, like, with the speed of which I'm doing this here, I somehow don't think I'll be able to do the central bus stop today. So, another time, another stream, and. I mean, it's just works very well with my general plans that well no videos for a while but instead of that i'm gonna do more streams so yeah probably next stream central bus up which will be fun to build i think because i actually still haven't done a proper bus hub so far so yeah, this will be really fun. Okay, that already fits. And uh, as I just noticed, I should move these a bit more so that they align with with this edge in the overhead wires here. Like this. And the rest still fits. What? Was a hint on your problems b from before with where you didn't where, where I wasn't able to pronounce question? You mean question? 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 See, no, it doesn't work anymore. Um, okay. So I see the tracks aren't parallel. Why aren't they parallel? We don't know. Good thing I'm Re Revo made some lamps for German yard so you can replace those street lamps. He did? You did? He did? You did? Yeah, I know I should replace those wooden paths. The thing I wanted to emulate with these wooden paths are um, these... these um, these these metal walking paths that I sometimes saw on um, on rail yards, and I wanted to sort of emulate them with these wood decals. But yeah, don't worry, I'm gonna 
I'm gonna delete them. Because um, one reason is they're just nuclear bright, <laughs> and other reason is that yeah, by now by now I know that um, they aren't realistic. Don't go so fast. What? 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 Okay. So we have. <laughs> I mean. It does look a bit ridiculous with these huge arms to the sides. Is it done like that? Or did I just make this up? <laughs> because it does look ridiculous. Okay. Tea time. Okay. Revo. Thanks. Thanks, babe. It's great. Um, but still that means I can delete them for n oops I can delete them for now and will replace them as soon as you made your metal sheets oh, nine, no. okay this is a bit annoying no uh, no <sighs> this is annoying. so and then these are gonna go for the love of God, replace those trains. Yes, yes, daddy, yes. I already did download um, newer models. You know, that's what I had three years ago. Also, they are made by you. At least um, the Twindex is made by you and that PESA train, that BR-280, 218 is not made by you. The Chanter is not made by you. <laughs> Oh god, come on. I actually have no idea who made them. And uh, I think that's also made by you, right? That Vectron. That Flirt? I'm not sure. Hey, Starcrafter HD. Uh, oh, that's annoying. Bye bye. Okay, and I don't think I have anything as of now to replace the street lamps with here. So, oops, there's a decal missing, or I missed a decal there. So for the time being, I just remove them. Because I don't think I sub to flood is node, vector yes, okay. Ha! Sucker, I knew it. Oh, well, I knew it. Didn't you know it, but okay. You didn't publish those green ant masts. What is your graphic card? I have a GTX 1070. That's serving me very well for... um Three years? Four years now, I think. So, yeah. Good graphic card. How many assets are you using at Wederstein? Um, actually, let me look it up. In the, um, the uh, loading screen mod file. I, I am using, I am using, uh, da, 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 5,000 assets. Wow, that's really not much. 5,000 assets. And using 21 gigabytes of RAM and yeah, 30, 30, 37 gigabytes of page file. Whoops. Okay. Let me go back to my stream and we can continue this whole charade. How do you get such a realistic light? I have the same graphic mod, but it looks like crap. Um, yeah, for the most, it is just a bit of trial and error to get the best real light settings. Um, you know, I can just show them to you. So, you can make quickly make a screenshot. These are my real light settings. They are... F I think most of them are from Electrix. These are my real light settings. Then I'm using this LUT. Then I have 
these oops these post process effects so feel free to quickly screenshot them or pause the stream or whatever uh, these are my post process settings oops that was needed and I'm also using um, reshade but I can't open it anymore it used to open with um, the position one key oh there it is okay I don't know if you can see it um, but I'm using reshade which adds a whole lot of new effects that you can apply it's basically just a filter that gets applied um, on top of the city skylines render engine it doesn't do that much in terms of overall overall um, lighting but it it helps with um, with like if you if, you, if especially if you have the sky in um, in the image it really helps with um, getting some depth in your lighting okay let's continue I'm just gonna copy that mask and probably place it yeah, here I think in the middle so that was that a good idea actually no 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 I'm gonna place it here where the wires connect where these wires connect so that this side stays as it is now with two uh, with three cantilevers so we can quickly it. but definitely Titan replace those retaining walls yes of course don't worry don't worry of course I'm gonna replace them I sub to all of them before the stream before last stream already naive as I was I expected to finish the station the last stream already well that didn't really work out but uh, yeah I'm, I'm gonna replace all of them uh, okay that's a bit tight now <laughs> tight. <clears throat> don't do that no 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 Boy, dirty jokes here. This is a this is a nice Christian stream. Okay, so this is now almost done as oops, as well, and a good. Uh, uh, okay, this is annoying now. No. No. It's faster to use um, another mast from yeah, maybe this one. Yep. How about this one? But what if I'm atheist? You're gonna burn in hell, baby. Actually, is that is, is, is that true for atheists in in in, uh, in, the, in Christianity? I have no idea. I seriously have no idea how, how that whole Christian stuff works. So, yeah. Don't quote me on that. You also should replace the walls on the HSR with more modern concrete ones. Yes. Yes. I will. But, yeah, the, the these retaining walls for the high speed track are a very critical thing. The problem is that... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come to that um, once this is done. These are these retaining walls are a very tricky thing. Does it work? Yes, it should. I'm gonna show you in a sec. So these retaining walls along the high speed track. Um, there is a high speed track now, but it's going directly through the city. So there have been tracks before otherwise it just would work which means why were there tracks before my idea is or which which raises the question why have there been tracks before my idea is that before this track was just used to um, connect the brewery that will be somewhere here 
to um, the rail line and maybe some yeah some other factory that was here but if it if this rail yes rebel this is three years old those are vanilla tracks um if these rails that used to be here only used to connect two um, factories there was no need for double rail which means there wouldn't have been enough space which just raises so many questions again so yeah I'm really not sure how to how, how to do that here or how to justify that um, Karl Sokan why don't you make a Christmas market similar to the ones in Nuremberg and Rotenburg ob der Taube? I was happy to visit them last year and I think they would look great in the game. Yeah, well, I already did a set of Christmas market assets, but I'm not going to talk about them. Because they, 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 yeah. Old. They are so old, and even when I, when I made them, they weren't really up to standard. So, yeah. I'd have to make a completely new Christmas market set. And with this semester, lots of uni stuff, I don't think I'll have the time for that. So, no Christmas market. Okay, so this works. And then we have another single mast here, hoping that it's high enough. Oh, on point. It has sound walls, yeah. It, it it will need to have sound walls, which is another problem, actually. So, yeah, this high-speed track that goes through the city causes so many problems and questions that it's... it's I've been thinking about it for a while and still am not 100% sure how to either justify having old um old embankments or having the high speed rail there or yeah whatever also i see there's no overhead wire here which yeah well not supposed to be like that but i'll quickly change that if i can access that segment that is well, an uh, Anschlussbahn towards the brewery wouldn't be double track. Yes, as I said. So the old walls would have to get replaced. Yes. Also, I can't say if they would be that good for higher speeds. I mean, that close to the station and between the station and that very steep slope, I don't think the speeds would be that high either way. What do you study? I am studying economics. Specializing in energy, energy economics and sustainable management as well as global markets and global finance. So yeah, this is what I'm studying. Okay, then we have this shit here. So I guess I'm gonna use a single mast here for this edge. Then a single mast for this edge. Break the tracks, then use that track as recre recreationary elevated section in city that once used for interest industry. You mean like removing the tracks? No. I want them there. Just... I basically only sort of need these tracks going through the city so I can build a proper modern high-speed line a bit later you know um, VDE 8 style like these have to be there because otherwise I can't make a high-speed line going here with a big bridge here and everything but yeah this all this whole area hasn't been touched since episode one and map creation so yeah you can have like an old tourist destination a bit further w along that railway and there would have been like a narrow gauge railway there yeah yeah well the thing is that doesn't work because it's just leading um, on top of the highlands here and historically this wouldn't make a whole lot of sense because I know that region and if at all historic lines would go along the valleys so um, yeah I think I'll just have to live with the fact that this line doesn't make a whole lot of sense 
Um, but yeah, let's just, you know, call it artistic freedom and I'm done with it. Okay. We have catenary masks everywhere here. This works now wonderfully as well. Next step will be um, the other part of, oops, ooh, ooh, ah. first of all, I have to, I have to make that a bit better. Don't you oversee my comment. What comment? You could add a high speed connection with an extra station like it is in Limburg or Limburg Süd. Uh, 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 I, why? Like, why? <laughs> Oops. Uh, this is problematic. Um, I guess I have to do it like this. And then this whole node has to be on a bit of a different spot. I guess like this. And then this segment can... Uh, oh, and, and so, and now this node has to be a bit closer to that other switch. This should be nodeless, and I'm gonna do that in a second. Uh, yeah, no, that, that looks like shit. I heard autistic freedom. <laughs> Our artistic freedom. Like like a pirate, you know? The, the artistic freedom. <laughs> Not the autistic. Uh, although I guess it would fit to me as well. Uh, so. Okay, that looks like shit. Is there a mod? Is there a move it in TF2? No. And that's, in my opinion, one of the biggest problems with the whole modding in um, Transport FIFA 2. Um, um, because because high-speed rail needs so many specialties not given in a narrow canyon station like this. Yeah. I mean... I think it works perfect here to have it like yeah maybe I don't know possibly the thing is on on things like this it really shows how old this project is that there are some some irregularities that just don't work with um, with the way it works in real life but um, that's just that's just how it is it's an old project and yeah I'm not gonna start another project every time I see some irregularities, because, yeah, it just is part of its history. Okay, how about we move that node and this as well, and this as well, <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, this, th that's better, because now we can put that in a straight line. This bit more like this and yeah I can live with that they would have to slow down very early so it would take a long time for an ICE maybe yes yes but as I said it's just some irregularities that do exist in an old town like this and just copy the old town and delete everything else and <laughs> no no this is an old project and I'm told uh, I mean I'm a super big perfectionist so I can't say I'm fine with these irregularities but let's say I learned to live with them it's it's okay it's okay if I can live with it you can live with it since Wederstein houses many rich Swiss people, they lobbied in Berlin to get the BAG to make an ICE line to the city. Yes. See? That's the spirit. 
Okay. Sleeper is not aligned, but oh well. Maybe one day. If I feel really bored some evening, I'm gonna align all the sleepers. So we're gonna remove these lamps and no more problems there, I think. Heidelberg, for example, has no ICE driving through the old town on the S-Bahn. Yeah, well, but that is also because Heidelberg, like, the, the I mean, the, 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 the location of Heidelberg isn't really that it's that inviting for a high-speed line to go there, because it's directly at the end of a very narrow valley, and there are other trains going along the Neckar Valley? I don't think so, right? Because that's then a bit of a different story compared to um, Wederstein. Because Wederstein um, always was like an important trading center along the um, Veda slash Elbe. And so it just was, you know, it just was... A, um, important for the uh, an important stop between German and Czech Republic and it's also the border station so okay bye bye Peter Bar thanks for stopping by meanwhile I just want high speed way from Zagreb to Berlin yeah um I also would like to have a high speed rail to Berlin but I don't think that's gonna happen either it's like you know, uh, DB is is they do things slower. Or, well, it's not even DB's fault. It's just our um, um, uh, minister of of infrastructure and traffic that is more focused on highways uh, rather than trains. A long, a very long story in Germany. A fun story. A fun and sad story. A fun person, but a sad story. But only S-Bahn... Okay. There are, but only S-Bahn and regional trains go to... Oh, true, true. I remember Mosbach has a, has a station. True, I remember. I saw that. Meanwhile, I just want a high-speed line from Amsterdam to Hanover. But actually, from Amsterdam to Hanover... Like... There are high-speed trains that go to Amsterdam from Cologne. Ah, okay, Cologne is quite a different corner of Germany than Hanover. So that's not really working. Okay. Um, yeah, okay. So, I'm just gonna... I'm mm -hmm. just gonna add a catenary on everyone every one of those tracks here single ones because I just have them in on my finger at the moment the yeah, next catenary which would be inside the maintenance shed and then some single ones on these switches here and I think then we're done I mean, with that side at least. Yay! Well, sort of. There is this, still this stretch and the wall and... Oh god, there's so many things. The Dresdner Bahn is actually built for 200 kilometers. I think that is enough for Dresden Berlin. I mean, it still would be nice to have 300 kilometers between Dresden and Berlin. Like... Especially with the um, BER connection, then you'd be at the at the airport um, in like what um, th uh, forty-five minutes. It would be just great. More creations around than I thought. Uh, da, da. Meanwhile, I just want electric trains to Haifa. Haifa, 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 Haifa. Isn't it Israel? You live in Israel now. Boy, you have to, you, like, you have to, to, to update us. Last time you were around, uh, I remember you got married in, 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 in Copenhagen, right? 
And now you're in Israel? We have to tell that. Good. Um, Ban Fanatica, are you still around? Because what to do on a double slip switch in terms of the uh, overhead wires? Pro probably just one on that side, one on that side, and one there and one there, right? I guess. Rebel, please. <laughs> Come on. Also, Dosto win. Mr. Worldwide, right here. Oh, yeah. But hey, let's really wait for him. Okay. So like this and that doesn't work now. That's a bit too close. <laughs> oh god, no, that looks like shit. No, we can't do it like that. Uh, oops, no. So I guess what we're... It works on these two. Um, wouldn't it be possible to do a tutorial series where you explain your solution for common problems with CS like stairs, etc. Um, yes, it would possible, but would be possible, but um, no videos from my side for at least two weeks, three weeks, if at all this year. No more videos. I just can't. More props than your entire city. Yeah, well, <laughs> that's that's sort of the the, the lottery you you take with. Um, if you go for high detailing, that's just you know, it always has lots of props, and it may be realistic, it may be unrealistic, but all these single beam catenaries um, between all these big masts just looks. Is it done like that, really? There's a very... Oh, that switch doesn't look too healthy over there. Oops. <clears throat> okay. Let's finish these last catenaries so we can move on. Question is... What am I gonna do with the double slip switch? And then from here I can just use normal catenaries like these, which are just so much faster. Um... I suppose for that switch here I need I need I need I need to do it like this just not <laughs> with the ad and can't deliver as long so let's copy that yeah it's <laughs> really like a roller coaster over there but let's let's yeah Given how switches and everything can work in this game, let's remain silent for a moment, because these uh, these switches here. Um, actually, that's the only one that's really critical. Um, this could cause some real problems with trains going o going over them. So we'll we'll see how that goes at the end. This has to be a bit higher, higher, higher like, uh, yeah, like this. Now we can align that side to this and finish this switch. Oh, <laughs> it's been, it's been a bit too long. Okay, so, and from the other side. Okay, again, that looks ridiculous. 
but I guess in this case, this is no problem. Oh, oops. So, um, if I do it. Oh. Nah, it's. Come on. So, I do it like this. Like, I, it's not perfect, but I guess it's the best solution for these tight wires here. It would be interesting to see building in a game, me building in a game, for example, like trains, where you could build the railways more detailed. It would. I actually thought about also um, doing other games on my channel, but uh, yeah, I sort of stuck with these guys. Got stuck with City Skylines. But uh, maybe now that all my videos are, at least for a while, uh, won't be possible that, um, yeah, maybe that would be something. Yes. Now kiss. Okay. Opinions? Because you, I, I, I like it. Just a few things like, um, yeah this that we have to smoothen out a bit don't yet know how to do that the easiest way but um, yeah that should be no problem then there is this which isn't supposed to be like that oh ah, come on okay um, I have to bring them all onto the same height which is problematic. Oh. Oops. Control H and yeah, well, now there's a gap here. Hmm. I like that race track. It has character. Maybe it has character, but it just makes no sense. How about Dark Souls? How about no? Actually, I don't even know how that game really is. I only know it from like a few screenshots and everything. Dead whale gap. Yes, I know, right? I know. Just make all nodes on the same height. Yeah, that is... Is it on a slope already here? Uh, no, not really. Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Everything on the same height as the platform tracks. <laughs> yeah, now we have this. I think Node Controller would be a good mod. I don't know if that's fixable with Node Controller. I haven't looked too much into it, but uh, yeah. Ooh, oh god, no. Press the wrong button. Sorry, what? What? <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna put it all on the same height and call it a day. At least up to that point. Yeah, much better. I mean, now we have this, but I think that's much easier Fixed. Although um, we had problems at the beginning of the stream with this track here, I see, but that's not necessarily that much of a problem. If we just put it all on a slope together, and now we have this, also interesting. Ah, shit. Ah, yes, that's what I wanted. Better. Um, not that gap. On the valley main track. Huh? What do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, there is something we need to fix. First of all, tea time. Okay. I mean, yeah, sure, um, ooh. yeah, sure, uh, 
Dosendackel. How do you come up with these names constantly? Uh, I'm sure Node Controller isn't necessarily needed, but I could imagine it just makes some things a little bit more easier. So this is now a weird slope as well, but this is that something for... Actually, we should do it now. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll forget about it or whatever. So... We're gonna have a straight slope over these segments. And what's missing now are just some single catenaries here. And then we're done with that side. Don't worry, the elevation behind the station is awful anyway. Ah, oh, thanks, I know. What shell gas station is it? Ah, uh, some asset from Sven Berlin. Don't ask me which one. Look in the look in the um, collections. I don't know which one. How do you come up with the name? With what name? With what name did I come up? What is the hotkey for adjusting height? Uh, Control H, yes. Which I also, yeah, only was reminded of in the last stream, cause I always did it the manual way with the buttons, which works just fine. But yeah, it's faster with Control H. It is not in your, it is in my collection. It definitely is in my collection. You can count your life on that. The name Titan. Um, the name Titan, yeah. I am notoriously uncreative when it comes to names. Like character names, nicknames, whatever. And so that name Titan is years and years and years old. Much older than my whole um, work in and with the City Skylines community. And when I needed th that name, it was like... Um, okay, I quickly need a name and that game I played at the moment was Heroes of Might and Magic, a really great strategy game and there are some titans as creature, creature and I, yeah, I just went with it. There's no real story behind it, I'm just notoriously uncreative when it comes to naming things. No, come, just go away. Okay, okay, uh, okay, that side of the station is done, it's uh, 1740, so how long are we gonna continue that now? Because the other side of the station, yeah, I vowed that I'm gonna do that as well today, which causes some problems time related problems well that was underwhelming sorry I guess just near that kissing catenaries there was a gap oh you mean that gap yeah we're gonna fix that uh -huh. so first of all we're gonna bring all this on the same height which it already was, perfect. So that now I can easily switch it to better um, retaining walls. Retain network. Hey, slot, schnabulier machine, dosentackel. Look, just mentioning it to trigger you. Okay, can I just use the arcades here? D didn't you also make some that have rails included? I thought so. Because I downloaded the whole set, apparently you didn't, <laughs> that's annoying. Okay, in that case, we're just gonna remove our Mesto sea walls. And... Gonna use your newer, much better looking retaining walls. 
empty as a train. And it's gone. Oh, you fixed it accidentally. Uh... Okay, then I really don't know what you meant. Um, entire pack is railway A. R W A slash. Uh, huh? I guess not. Like, shouldn't it appear here now or? Oh, now the... Didn't I... Didn't I just also type arcade or... or? Okay, I have no idea. Oh, uh, I have no idea. Didn't I just also search for arcade? Whatever. Um, nobody actually believed you would get to the other side. That's just mean now. That's just mean. Also, I hope my microphone didn't... Uh, over... 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 Um, übersteuern, over. I hope my microphone could handle my loud talking now. And didn't cause ear cancer. So. Oh, surface is right. You typed retain. Ah. You see, talking and doing stuff at the same time is tricky. It, it really is tricky and it, yeah then uh, these things happen to like type retaining or retain instead of arcade or something and yeah okay I deleted these surfaces then there are these big ones that I'm also gonna delete for a second because I don't know if I actually need them there oh yeah I definitely need them there okay they're gonna stay ear cancer that's the first Okay. Good, good, good. This will be fixed with a surface prop. So what I'm gonna use here, I think this would work well. All right. They have the different gravel. Hmm. Hmm. First of all, I wanna look where the transition is. So what do we have here? A track that hides the gap. And there is the transition. So these are standard tracks that I can just switch, I guess. But make them elevated. Actually, I think they are already elevated, but I don't know. Okay, how does that look? It's a bit massive. Also, it's flying. You made them very short. I remember we had the discussion whether how tall to make them, but now they're too short. Okay. You startled me a bit. Oh, uh, okay. Or use retaining walls. Yep. Holy gibberish, that's smooth. Okay. So, yeah, I'm gonna use retaining walls because it'll be easier. Here, it's also flying, so yeah, retaining wall networks will be better here. Runny. It's easier to find with Runny. Um, double electrified nodeless. Actually, I can use nodes here. Or maybe not. This is okay. And then I'm just gonna plop retaining walls. Retaining we we take we retain. You said seven meters. I did seven meters. Yes, I said but it turns out for this case it's not high enough. In general it's perfectly fine though. Um this is the gas station. It is definitely in the collection. 
I, I, I bet my life on that. It is in the collection. Because I switched mod setups between Ansborg and Vedastein. And on Ansborg I didn't have it. And in Vedastein I have it. Which means it's definitely in the Vedastein collection. Okay, retaining walls. That means I can only use the very big retaining walls. Question is, which ones to use? We have this one, the dark weathered stone. I don't want end, I want this. We have this one and I don't think I want to use this one because it's too bright. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna use the very dark stone. I'd use that one if it was yellow, like in sandstone, but white as in, I guess, uh, limestone, I don't know. Nah, I don't want to use those. Okay, dark ones it is. Uh, which ones? Do I want the arches? Question is if it's big enough for the arches to be visible, but that's easily fixed. Let's just try it with the arches first. So, there, 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 and all the way to this bridge there. And I guess it's enough if I bring it to the same height as the tracks now. Yes, it is. There a note? Nope. But uh, there was one. Then just on the same height as. Well, thanks for nothing. Mm -hmm. But why didn't you made height adjustable like this wall? The tie. Okay. Because of bottom, it has stone ground. So okay. Talking about the gas station. I guess. So we can't align this one properly, I guess. We'll try later. Let's bring this to the same height. Actually, I should just have a retaining no wall node everywhere where there is a track node, because that would make things so much easier. Are the arches visible? Oh, yes, they are. Great. So then we can keep it like that. Mm, this looks oh mm, 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 oh yeah, with clipping even. Mm. What happened? Let's compare taste this one more time. Chat. Uh, chicken stew with mushrooms and sour cream. Chicken stew with mushrooms or sour cream. I don't like mushrooms. Chat, your opinion? Chicken stew with mushrooms and sour cream? With sour cream? Yes, totally. Mushrooms are just a personal opinion of mine. Okay, let's bring this to the same height as this track. So that afterwards I hope it'll be easier. Uh, this can be here, I think. And then we have this node that goes to that height. Um, well, let's... No. Let's move it there, otherwise the arches are way too stretched. Uh, next node is there. And voila. And then there is a node, and so it should be done. What I'm doing now is just aligning these nodes properly, which <laughs> more or less works. The segments. And now we have some actual good looking retaining walls instead of these, I mean, 
I don't want to shit talk Armesto because the, uh, the these retaining walls from him that I had before are of course very old but yeah they're really uh, not to modern standards anymore all right let's just copy these surfaces here that they should be on the right side no let's move them a bit up and just select them all and bring them to the same height which I think they have already been but whatever uh, this is annoying like I just want to get rid of the black shadows there but seems that means that the surface props are higher than the retaining wall which I'll have to change as well this has to be fixed. No, I don't know why I didn't put surface props there before. Okay. Oops. This, this four have to be a tiny bit higher. Now they're hiding other tracks as well. Hmm. <coughs> That's annoying. I'm just drink a cup, a sip of tea. You still didn't add the grass, the gaps. Uh, in a sec. Okay. So, oh, first of all, there are some catenaries missing here, which I'm gonna add in a second, I think. First of all, this has to be even out and it's still not mm -hmm. okay better now now it's better it really looks like transport fever it's crazy well mission accomplished I guess Okay, so what to do with that shadow? I guess I just have to use smaller surface props, but that uh, Actually, I'm just gonna use I'm gonna keep the big surface props and Use smaller ones nonetheless Gravel uh, Like this I guess problem is we have to gonna we'll have to raise the retaining wall as well but no oh. now that's just annoying I guess this works it's yeah it's it's I, th I think it's good enough we're gonna raise the retaining wall afterwards like these black shadows are still visible but only between the sleepers which uh, yeah it's it's okay it's okay I wish a game existed that came sort of across between CS and GPF I mean if you're if you're not missing these um, freight and yeah if you're not missing the freight mechanics you can do everything in city skylines that you can also do in transport fever the freight mechanics and the better track and line management but seriously with railway you don't need that anymore um, yeah city skylines is better than transport fever at least um, with the modding community this game here has and Transport Fever really doesn't have. Okay, Z Green Gaming, thanks for stopping by. And I wish you a good appetite. That's not how you say it in English. <laughs> um, have fun eating lunch. Okay, Catenaries and then just some grass props and we're done.
question is, yeah, the other side of the station still remains. And, yeah, I mean, I said I'm going to do it today, but seriously. Uh, it's just much easier said than actually done, you know. Oh, look, the tracks are too close together. Uh. Stop being cringe. Hey. What you mean? So, and I guess we'll have to turn those into, P into a PO. Uh, the glitch over there. Look. Almost done, almost done, almost done, almost done. Who the hell eats lunch at 6 p.m.? Yeah, I guess he isn't from Europe. And in that case, it would be totally fine to eat lunch at probably 1 p.m. Okay. Um. Um. I. Is that. Is that fig. Oh, it's it's, 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 it's it's already at 300%. What's this? And why is it? That's unfortunate. Titan face reveal. I mean, my face has been revealed almost a year, more than a year ago by now. You just have to find it. But it's, yeah, it has been shown already on various occasions. Okay, so I'm gonna just put some grass decals here and a few more bushes and small trees. And then I'll have to come up with some fix for these, um, for the, for these glitching surface props. First of all, I have to bring those to the same height. And these grass props, yeah, I have to switch them for other grass props. Or for none at all, because only with the decals, it doesn't look too bad, to be honest. Lost Titan. Eh, what do you mean? Uh. Lunchtime is when I'm hungry. I mean, I have pretty like regular lunch times. Usually for us, lunchtime is between 12 and and uh, 1. Whereas dinner time is always at yeah, 6 and 7. Meaning this stream now, and to be more precise, Finishing the other side of the station gets it causes some conflicts with my usual time management. Um, without that container, or without that uh, thingy. Um, oh, there is another end catenary that I need. Oh, it's PO. All right, no problem. It's a PO, so. Oh, I need to add some buffers, I just noticed. Wait, Railway has buffers, so either I didn't activate them with Railway Replacer or I just sub to them, which is just as likely, I think. Uh. Ooh. Holy shit, what did I do? What was that? Okay. I just pressed some very wrong buttons. What is Railway Replacer again? <laughs> Fun fact, don't press Ctrl and R, it does weird things. I don't know, I don't wanna know. Good.
Looking at this now, I personally per personally like it very much. Also, we are actually playing with 300% um, dynamic resolution the whole time. And it's just running smoothly, it's fine. Um, yeah, what do you say? Are you fine with how it looks now? What bo really bothers me are these surface networks, but uh, these surface props there. Question is, what can I do about them? Cause I, if I, um, if I decrease them in height, um, they don't serve their purpose anymore of hiding the black shadow. But if I keep them like that, well, I'm keeping them like that. Why is the number on the 280 mirrored? <laughs> Yeah, well, it is mirrored because whoever made that model is an, is an idiot. Because, like, but you you also see that this model is... Mm, yeah. Oh, I just forgot to disable 300% dynamic resolution, but... Seriously, it's working fine. I mean... Sure, let's disable it or let's turn it down, but seriously, it's working fine. This, this bothers me. So it's a decision between this as soon as we zoom out a bit more or the black shadows which is like the classic pest and color decision oops surfaces i mean i guess this works better yeah but well, now we have this which is also yeah because you have speed slider slowed down oh yeah true very true But yeah, of course I have speed slider um, turned down. I always have it turned down when I'm just building. Do you plan to detail switches as well? Not anymore as they are now. Like, uh, is it even possible to detail them more? I'm not sure if Revo, who else would it be, also made more. One thing that I... I mean, I can't say I want to do it, but I'm supposed to do our signals, but yeah, that's, I think that's a whole different topic. What I'm going to do now is removing all these old trains. Terraform the area, lower the terrain with terraform networks. If I lower the terrain on that spot even more, then the black shadows will be stronger. Please delete the trains, they are too bright. Yes! You see? Et voila. I also made switches. Okay, you made switches. Okay. Well, could do, but at least not for now. Let's see. Okay. I forgot to sub the trains. Hmm? We need signs at the end of platforms. I need so many things. Um, let's at least use these. Uh, I mean, no. I think uh, we're gonna put some trains here on another day when I downloaded some more. I actually thought I have more, but yeah, should have just checked that. quickly gonna drink something <clears throat> all right I guess by now it's, it's like it's not a that much of a problem to just you know uh, continue on the other side of the station and quickly um, make this whole mess here a bit better like <laughs> what's this come on oh true there is also this that I totally forgot <laughs> did you 
just say War Pattern League? I guess you leaked it, not me. Okay, so we are gonna remove these platform. Oh god, that's gonna be so annoying to replant them. <laughs> you know, now I really wish I had done some networks. Guess what? I didn't. Okay, bye Verum. Good. And I think now I'm just gonna use Prob Angel because it's gonna be so much quicker. Um, but I'm platform. Platform, terrain conforming, not terrain conforming. 60 meters, perfect. Um, flip. Actually, I'm gonna do it like, I don't know, 15.9 or something. Just um, so in curves, um, they're closer together. gonna switch those after that um, hoping I can do it as fast as possible um, the other side of the station now and yeah then I'm done for the day but let's see how that goes hey didn't I yeah. let the tracks from the HSR directly connecting towards the other tracks so that ICE doesn't need to slow down for switches. I mean, here's a station, so there is no need to slow down for the switches because the ICE is stopping at that station. And yes, it is stopping. Yes, ICEs are stopping in a 30k shithole. No, it's not a shithole. But in a, 30, in a town of 30k, it in this case, it happens. Just for you know, um, I suppose it sort of also has to stop here because it's a border station. So um, yeah, no need for um, no need to be careful about the switches here because ICEs stop in Bederstein. to the same height and but I guess not every ICE is stopping um yeah I guess that's a good point I don't know if every ICE I mean how is it with border stations isn't like with the border station isn't every train supposed to stop there for I don't know um, switching personnel and stuff train train staff would sort of make sense to me these old signals we're gonna remove especially the semaphore signals and <laughs> this mess is also do looking great all right I'm just gonna wait for your reply so if given this is a border station where train staff also is changed should um, every train stop here or not because like um, in the real Elbe Valley, there is the small town of Bad Schandau, which is even much smaller than Wederstein. And all trains stop there. All. Every Euro city and every rail jet stop at Bad Schandau. Because it's, borders. it's the border station and Bad Schandau has, I don't know, maybe 6,000 inhabitants. So, yeah. Go. So clearly, it does not happen in Dresden already. And I know it, because like, um, DB staff is on board the train all the way between Dresden and Bad Schandau. And in Bad Schandau, 
or in the Chin, the um, JD staff enters the train. Okay. Oh God, what is this mess? Mm. Yikes. So, first of all, I'm gonna... Runny? I'm gonna turn it into... Whale, way invisible cat in here, yes. Into bi directional thing. Um, ground. Yes. And then I'm gonna sort that out. What's that? Ah. And then is then there is this mess here where we have to do another oh god another transition between double and single rail. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> mm, what is this? And why is it there? Um. No, okay. It's just you. Yeah. I don't know. I seriously don't know. Um. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. I guess I'm gonna use a noted single rail here. First of all, I'm gonna bring everything onto the same height. Well, on the other side, there is Emmerich am Rhein, where every ICE is passing by. So now we have two examples and don't know what to do. Is it right? So both cases are possible. Either every ICE stops here or no or anything in between. In which case I just take the artistic liberty. I mean, what we're talking about anyway. Mm. Oh. Yikes. What we're talking about anyway is just like the amount of switches that have to be here or, you know. And so it's like not a big deal. Oh, yeah. We have a baby. In case you're still watching, look at this. Look at it closely. And I hope now you're so much triggered that you're gonna make tostos, because otherwise I'll have to continue using this. Your call. <laughs> Good, so let's do this and then we're done. Cursed, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> yes, now please open Blender, open your references and go. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna keep the switch uh, or uh, this transition as simple as it is here at the moment. Because, yeah, I don't think it's. I think it works. Then there is this connection that I want to have a bit later. Oh, actually, no. I don't want to have it a bit later. Oh, what's this now? Okay, so. Um, let's connect this there. I think we're gonna need two nodes there. Oof. So, I think we're gonna need two nodes there. And then we can... We can... Do a proper switch like this, or a proper like curve like this. Ooglu transition. Yeah, you mean this? Yeah. Is it though? Is it? Cause like, what really bothers me here is, I mean next to that slope, is that I don't want to 
I have to transition from single to double track here. On the other side, you're probably right. It would be much better to have the transition here. Much, much better. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. You are very, very right. Um, so we're gonna move that a bit sort of upstream and okay so I seriously have to look it up there is the purely cosmetic track and then there is node 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 less or node doesn't matter doesn't matter and in between the purely cosmetic track all right I don't know proper English terms but this couldn't exist in, in real life because the moving parts are directly on the crossing of single race yeah you're right you're right you're right you're right you're right I, I get what you mean you're right hence the worth and we're gonna fix that now I think I should use elevated here noted and uh, the thing is it is too close to the station for for noted at least or I, I don't know I don't know let me just do it like this and do it like this and now we have that which we don't want I guess it would work but in such an X crossing is not that realistic I imagine so this is what we want which is not I know it's not the like perfect way to do railway um, transitions the thing is that I don't really have the space base to do it better and I don't want to move it even further away from the station at least for now because that would create a whole lot of other things that needed to be fixed which I don't want to do at the moment at least so what I'm doing is oops Voila. okay what I'm doing is like uh, oh there was a terraforming network like this so we align them and it's not the most perfect transition but at least for now I'm gonna keep it like that at least for now What I don't know is if it will actually work as intended or if the trains will glitch and jump and whatever crazy stuff they do. Uh, but that's, yeah, we'll, we'll find that out in a bit, hopefully. <clears throat> so, and then there is the freight track that I guess will directly connect to that um, segment over there. Did I use elevated there? I think so, right? Yeah, elevated. So, like this, and then it connects to that. Hi, Demolition Daddy. Haven't you been here all the time? Or earlier today, because I think I already saw your name. But I might be wrong. Okay, these are, I think, too close now. So let's just uh, move that a bit away. Same goes for this. Oh, well, no, here it's not necessary. Uh, Earlier I had to do stuff. Alright. Well then, 
welcome back to the stream. But I have a feeling it's slowly coming to an end. <laughs> slowly. At least I'm almost done with um, all the things I wanted to do today. So we have this. This has to be a bit smoother. Is this fine? Probably not. At least I don't want it like this. Okay. No? Better. Oof. What's that? No. No, 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 no. Yes. That's a better curve. So the first two tracks are connected to the main line. And as Bahn Fanatica wanted to have the main sort of high speed tracks directly connected, this would be the two um, middle ones there, platforms, what, four and five? We actually can do that. Never mind. See, what a pointless discussion did we have. Yes, we can, we can, I can totally do that. Um, this would cause a triple switch there, which is not a thing. Okay, so the freight line will be even shorter. Oh well. Okay, and then freight will directly connect there. This now there is this mess. First of all, let's bring it all to the same height again. Oh, they're still elevated. My bad. Hey. Ground. Oh yeah, that's better. I accidentally made them all into Elevated tracks, which I do not want there. Okay, I hope all segments are covered now. And there are these that, yeah, they can be elevated. I'm basically confused by the tracks now. Um, what you mean? I mean, it's not done, of course. But it'll be very soon. Now that's a bit close there. Oh well. Ah yes, perfect. That's a great curve. Now let's have that same curve over here see it doesn't perfectly align this is a bit too close there by which I now destroyed the um, catenary connection there but or um, alignment there mm. so. so now with something? No, everything is in the same height here, so this and this. So then what is going on? Ah no, okay, now it's fixed. Barry Chen, why are you confused by the tracks? 
we have the two main tracks that go directly to platforms um, 4 and 5. That platform... Oh, that me actually now means we can extend the platforms a bit, which is great news. And then the other tracks will slowly um, fade into the two main tracks. And well, it's already <laughs> half past six. So, I mean, I guess once I'm done with the tracks, I'll, yeah, I'll end it here. And with the next time, whenever that may be, but probably in less than a week, um, with the next, mm -hmm. oops. with the next stream, we can then finish this at least the other side is finished now and I have something to show great what's this a surface prop okay you could extend the freight train track a little bit further I guess yes I could yes I could but next time if the next time not today because I'm I'm starting to get burned out for um, today so um, remind me next time please okay we're gonna fix that with surface props catenaries next time um, I'm not I'm not really in the mood to do uh, it today I feel. So the last thing now will be connecting that dead end over there for shunting trains to platform track six. And then I'm done for today. So I think the signal box will have to move a bit. Maybe, I don't know, it actually won't. And the last thing now is just connecting this to, well, thanks. No, I can't see shit. Um, so we're gonna, uh, this and then to this. And now I can't select this note and uh, this segment there. Of course not. Um, it's somewhat working, so let's do it like this. And okay, then we'll remove those grass props as well as these grass tufts that I'm yeah gonna add later. Later. This isn't supposed to be overgrown. Bye bye. Um, I'm gonna quickly add some surface props and then I'm done for the day. In the meantime, look at this. Tell me if it's good enough or not. I think this curve is necessary, but it could instead go to yeah, somewhere directly over there. Yeah. Do tell me if it's okay like that or not. Um, I think I actually will move the transition um, from from a double track to single track a bit further down the line just to make it look better but yeah next time really next time just as the bus up because uh, I did what I wanted to do finish that side and also finish the other side almost so to say and yeah same goes for I'm um, the retaining wall I can already make that's no problem. Okay, so let's just add some The train is clipping the platform. It was? Oh I, I didn't notice that. But um, if that's the case then Yeah, I'm gonna fix that next time. So I think these tracks are lower than all the other tracks. So let me just select all nodes that are here. And yeah, 
Mm, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for nothing. Okay. Quickly removing those wall props. But for next time you could go with your shopping cart through the workshop so you won't miss anything. You know, earlier today, meaning an hour before I started the stream, I wrote into the Vedastein channel of my Discord, guys, this is what I'm doing, tell me what I could, need and might miss. Um, nobody replied. So I'm blaming that totally on you. <laughs> of, co of course you don't know what I have, but uh, yeah, I'm blaming that totally on you. Up, 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 down, down, uh, okay. So last thing now, adding the better retaining wall net. No, that's really annoying. It's, I don't know why. Now it's working. So they're just too high. So if we take these surfaces here, all of them, and remove them. Ah, okay, yeah, now it's better. Same goes for those. Moving them down a bit, yeah, better. It's fair, I guess. Same goes for those that are too high, I think. If I was actually, why did why did I use small ones there? You just the big the big stuff. Tuck, tuck. No need for the small ones to use. The, oh, oh, I had something. <laughs> okay. Ah, but they're not the same height. I see. So now this is working better this is glitching wonderful okay hmm z fighting and bank retaining wall not embankment and uh, which one did i use that one yeah so we're just gonna plop them down along the rails all right excellent this has to be straight Oh, um, what just comes into my mind, how do you like the music that is in the background now? Um, I'm just thinking it's not too loud for you, because nobody um, complained. But is it fine, this uh, yeah, bit of smooth, um, calm rock music? Because, um, yeah, it's just for me much better than some jazz in the background. What I also could put in the background would be some um, classic music, uh, but I don't, I don't know if anyone is really into like classic music and even baroque music, which I hear often when I'm building, because like I really feel it's, yeah, it's it's really good good music if you're working on something. So yeah, give me your opinion. If of the music if you have something to say. All right. Um, Stravinsky. Uh, what? Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I like to listen to it, but it's not like I'm a pro and know every composer and yeah. First of all, I'm gonna save. And um, we have 33.2 already. Uh, what is it one day? It's not supposed to be there. Yeah, either way. Actually, no, let me. 33.22. 2. 
not Baroque, some actual classic. I mean, you can't say actual classic music and not Baroque. Baroque music is very much classical music, so yeah. I, for example, I very much like listen to Bach, um, Vivaldi or Handel, which are just some very great composers. Tchaikovsky, of course, is... That's then real um, sort of more classic, classic music. Um, the, the kind of classic music that more people think of when the term classic, uh, classic music comes into mind. Okay, let me just save another one. Okay. Mm, Chopin is also nice, yes. Hey, Mr. Mason. Uh, you are, you're just um, passing by at the end of the stream. But, hello. Great seeing you. So, yep. What we did today. And, yeah, well, uh, you be the judge if we achieved lot to, a lot today. Oh, that's still not supposed to be like that. But I guess um, platform detailing will also be um, the next for the next stream. Um, you be the judge if we actually achieved something today or if it's just meh, not as much. Um, placing all the catenary masts manually just takes some time. Either way, this side of the station is now yeah, pretty much completely done. What is missing may, might be some more grass props and of course the signals as many of them as I can um, plop down reasonably and some more trains as decorations. Then there are the platforms and the other side of the station is well I would say the tracks are almost done. This one should probably really go a bit more straight and only um, connect to the other tracks over there. But that's no problem. That's something for the next stream. Whenever that may be, um, I probably decide sort of spontaneously. Yep. I think Baroque music is not good for, is good for not distracting background music, but obviously classic music before 1860 is music. <laughs> Sorry, what? Placeholder cat still. What? What you mean? Oh, you mean, you mean, you mean, you mean those? Or what do you mean with placeholder cats? What about some earlier romanticism, romanticism music? You mean like, um, you mean like, um, come on, um, you mean like Richard Wagner? That's too, too, too much for building like it's too it's too grand <laughs> okay enough for the day this is what we did today um gonna make i'm gonna try taking some or actually i can already try taking some screenshots that i can share later I came for the bus station detailing. Ah, I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. We're gonna do the bus station next time. You see that I, 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 yeah. I didn't think that it would take that long today, but oh well, it did. So we're gonna do that next time. Either way, um, yeah, I'm gonna wrap this up here and continue making some more pictures or taking some more pictures when you're gone. Um, thank you for stopping by on the stream today. Um, I guess we're really gonna make that a... Hey, Julius. Sorry. I'm sorry. Hey. <laughs> um, I think we're go really gonna make this a bit more of a regular thing um, that I stream a bit more often. And yeah. Thanks for stopping by. Um, I'll see you like there, there are still single tech uh, cats overlapping cantilevers. Ah, yes, yes, yes. That is something that I will fix. Probably off screen. Yeah, well, you are... I'm streaming for almost four hours. I'm sorry, but 
have to stop at some point. I'm also getting really hungry. So again, thanks for stopping by, people. It was a great time. I definitely had fun making this and I hope you also enjoyed it. So next time we are definitely gonna make the bus stop, the central bus hub. Yeah, sorry Julius, you came too late. And until then, have a nice time, stay healthy. In these times, definitely try your best to stay healthy. Um, stay tuned and we'll see. We'll meet again the next episode. Until then, bye.